Come on, everybody, look at this place. Ha. Can I hear some Holy Ghost crazy noise for Jesus? On Tuesday, he added another young to me. Yeah. Our first year to him. And then the other thing I want to thank God was that on 22nd, as home fellowships in the Northern Zone, we had an overnight. All home fellowship gathered together and it was powerful. God was glorious. We thank you for having enabled us to make it through. God bless you. Amen. Praise the Lord, Church. On Wednesday, right after Sandra's birthday. We made 14 years in our marriage. We want to give God all the glory for that. And today is my wife's birthday. Happy birthday, Sandra. Praise the Lord. My name is Sway. I want to thank God for his goodness. Uh, during the 21 days of fasting, the Lord blessed us with two major things. The Lord gave us a land and a very big one. And another thing, I want to thank God uh, on 29th April, I met another year. And after praying at midnight, at around 2, when I went to sleep, the devil sent an agent in my house. And as I was sleeping, I think the thing wanted to take my life. But God empowered my spirit to fight. I called upon the, the blood of Jesus, and I woke up calling upon the blood of Jesus, and my I woke up when my husband was praying for me as well. So I thank God he delivered me from death. Amen. Praise the Lord. My name is Florence Chokshaba. I thank the Lord so much for the many things he's done. A few highlights. I thank him for healing. He has divinely healed me. Uh, he saved me from a very terrible accident. I also thank him for that. Uh, for, the, for the last seven months, I've not been working, but has provided amazingly. And the epitome is uh, tomorrow uh, I'll start on my new job. Has blessed me with a job. And the highlight about this job is uh, my former workplace, I resigned and suddenly they called me back and uh, gave me an amazing job. During the interview, these guys were giving me answers to give to the, Kenyans, the Kenyan team during the interview. I was believing God for a car and this job comes with one, so I bless him so much. Yeah. Praise the Lord Church. I'm Margaret. I thank God so much for giving me a new heart. I easily get angry and I had bitterness within me. I prayed and prayed and prayed and it had persisted. But last year, Papa called us, anyone who had such a problem. He prayed for us and since then, I have been healed and delivered. I get great. Praise the Lord. I'm so happy this morning to glorify the name of the Lord. It has added me another name when um last year uh, uh, as far as God because that was my prayer request 15 and he also gave us favor during that time. Glory goes to the Lord. Praise God Church. We are here to give God back the glory. Just a small account uh, in uh, 2010, the ninth year of the other marriage. The devil brought it down. And for five years, we were separated with no hope of restoration. But I thank the God of living by the same day. I thank the God of living by the same day because he restored our marriage. And not only restoration, our marriage was sanctified and laid on the right foundation. his provision. I thank him for the excellence he had given me. Yesterday I picked my final results and uh, 
The final semester, I took a step of faith. I said, I'll teach myself. And I want to thank God. I excelled with distinctions only. I praise the name of Jehovah. <laughs> praise God, church. My name is Angela. I'm here to thank God for his protection. Um, on Wednesday last week, um, my husband and I were attacked at our gates by thieves um, who broke, shattered the, the windscreens of our, of our car. They threw a big stone and the stone passed me and it went and threw the car and hit our gate and brought a tint, sorry, a dent on our gate. My, my whole body was filled with fragments. They took my phone. The Lord spared my life. The glasses did not cut me. They did not take my handbag. They did not take the laptops. Um, but I want to thank God very much because he speaks to us. He had spoken to my mother the previous night. She woke up in a dream and the Lord told her something is going, going to go very wrong. So she prayed from midnight to morning. And when I called her the following day, she, she knew it. She knew that I was protected by the Lord. In fact, when I went to hospital, the doctors were very surprised that nothing had happened because I was full of fragments. I was in glass, but nothing had touched my body. Amen. Secondly, I want to thank the Lord very much. Um, he fights our battles. When God lifted me up at my place of work, um, there was someone, I think, who thought he would take that position. So he fought me so much. This was a senior employee in the team who was handling a very important part of our business, and I relied on him because I knew nothing in, in that particular part of the business. But he fought me so hard, he refused. Um, he would not give information to me, and I found it very difficult to do my job. But what I remember is I remember that Papa had prayed for me, so I went to Sam's 35. Every at midnight, I would pray in Psalms 35, and I would, I would pray to the Lord to help me. And um, when I went out to Paris, when I came back, that employee had resigned and left the company. Yeah. Praise God, Church. I'm God Anna. I greet you in Jesus' name. I want to thank God who delivered me from a swelling on my lower gum. I had a swelling since, January, since November up to almost the last month. And this swelling disturbed the doctors. I went to dentist, dental clinic and they said they wanted to operate me, that is in Morocco. But the first thing they put one operation bed, then the senior doctor came and said, ah, ah, we are not going to operate you. But I could pray, say, God, if this operation is not, you are not in this operation, they should not operate me. And they told me, you go, you come back next week. Next week I went, and until when they told me, you go take the medicine and wait and see what will happen. But I thank God the swelling disappeared. By the same. Second testament, I want to thank God for Johnny Masses and his protection. I lost my aunt last week, that she died on Tuesday. I thank God that he protected us, he safeguarded us, he provided for us. My aunt died at the age of 96, with 50 grandchildren and great-grandchildren, 25. <laughs> Let's go, church. Let's go, church. Yes. Yes. How can you? Yes. Oh my God, my heart is full of joy for what happened here on Sunday. Yes. I feel I just want to kneel down. Can I kneel down so I can? I feel. Thank God for this church, for Pastor Ben, for his wife, for Pastor Betty, for everyone who played a part in my wedding. And my heart is full of joy. I thank God because he came through for me at the last moment. He provided for me from here up to the reception and everything was successful. I give glory and the honor back to God.
Jesus, our crisis will never fails. King of Kings, we thank you for we know we cannot uh, thank you enough. Thank you for every testimony. We thank you for the miracles that you've done in our ministry. We thank you for the mighty and great things that you've done. We cover every testimony in the precious blood of Jesus. Lord, we seal them and declare that they shall be pardoned. We bless your name in Jesus' name.